video today we're doing the obs tutorial video on how to set up a 24 7 music live stream before we get this video i want to say thank you so much for the support on the other video it's sitting on that 1600 views right now thanks so much for the support lady um me filming this right now i'm dead tired but you know i will get the content out and um i, do, I love making these i enjoy it so sorry if it's not been one for two weeks um as you'll see the channel you know, I've done a few role plays with uh, Josh. I'll put his link in the description of his channel. Um, obviously, we made quite a few. There's quite a bit of five more to come out. So, yeah. Today, we're on how to set up a 24 7 music live stream. Before, I did how to do 720p 30 settings for the best CPU settings. They were in the 720p 30. Well, it doesn't matter what quality. I've just got with the quality I put you. Uh, it's just for how to set up a 24 7 music live stream. Like, Having it really low bit rate, lowest you can you can what makes you looks good. The lowest frame rates you can do, you know, to make it last forever. And what I would recommend doing is just chucking it on an old PC like I used to. I used to do it. Well, I don't do it as much now, but if I do them, I'd leave off a couple of days. But I have an old PC, what I normally do it on. But you know, obviously for the demos for this video, I cannot film in that because it wouldn't handle it. So yeah. If I think you want to install OBS, go to my other OBS video to find out how to install it. Just so you get on here, you start like this, it will ask you to do auto things, so you know. First thing I'm going to do is obviously go to settings. In general tab, just leave plain. Stream, whatever you're streaming to, it most commonly is YouTube or Twitch. But do quarterly to whatever you're streaming to. If you can't find one you want, you press show all. There's so many options. And if you do can't find what you're looking for, um, I've totally. But if you do can't find what you're finding for, you do like a sh custom streaming thing. If you want to find that, just search on YouTube. I'll put a video up one day, but not today. So, if it's my wasn't live stream, you could leave it simple, but I wouldn't recommend it. So go to Advanced, on Tick Info Streaming Server in Code Settings. Bit weight, bit weight is 500 is more than enough for the quality, the video the quality we're going to do. CBR is good uh, if you're streaming on Twitch. It is for so CBR, but if you're on YouTube, anything works. But CBR is the most common one. Key for Invital, I think what you call it, two. YouTube and Twitch, and every platform supports it, so just give it a two. CPU, it's super fast. Profile, high or main, high. High is for PC and PS4 users have a uh, quicker, quicker connect and better quality or main is for mobile so it depends on your users. Most people do watch on mobile but just keep it high. Uh, obviously if the quality is bad turn it up but normally super fast works perfectly fine with that bit of weight. So for recording, this could be recording as well so if you want like this will call a bit of music. So recording just go to MP4. X2, X264. Recording is a totally different thing. Recording you want 6000, but you could put it lower and put it to high as well. Then, all J bit weight. What? If you want to switch, you're forced 160, so leave it 160. Um, if you're YouTube, it don't matter, or anything like that, it's open. But 160 is a normal, like. Um, at. You don't want to go no lower than that, really. Um, but that was me. Just chuck it all at 320 if you've got the internet to handle it, because then you can have the highest quality possible, even though the songs are not it. It would help it as well. But obviously, you do this for what you call it. Do it thingy to whatever songs you are listening to. So, what are some of your possible properties and see what audio bit rate? Uh, but 320 is if you put, obviously it's a music stream, so you want it to be good quality. So yeah, the audio is the most important part of music streams, event streaming, quality of the image, is the audio. Wave of profit, untick it, audio. 44.1 is the most natural sound you can get possible. 48 is good, but YouTube and Twitch recommend 44. 
so it, if you go through the recommended it will code properly obviously it will be the one what codes most quickest so here it is that just the audio whatever it is but obviously you won't use mic but you do what you call whatever you use and leave all that out the base output so you're not down scan but 720 by 720 while in there 10 fps you're totally fine or if you want to put lower fps you press this one here and you type in it could be one frame but just leave it at 10 10 will be good enough and leave it there hot keys don't need hot keys this it comes default normal put it to high color source 601 looks nice but obviously for the for me i will call him 601 color space because i don't need the color uh, from images and that you do want the red color you do it weighs in, in vibrance of colors more so for images you do so put it 709 and leave it partial but you do it to whatever you if the images are quite dark you put them higher it, it, it depends on whatever you're using to be honest and yeah leave it all the default and that was it and now a uh, good little tip is install vlc 64 64 bit version and you get this so just say um you don't want to have it on your you know built-in thingy and you physically i physically download the music of each song from the official ncs website so i've got them all here just so example we're going to add just a few of them and you press shuffle if you wanted to shuffle and that will just keep looping and looping with them songs in it and there's no interference with this, so you can just pick this away. You can just undo it. That's one best way to do it. So then obviously you add your images. You so for me I'll go image. Uh yeah, image. Obviously you do images quickly, obviously. It depends what image you want, it depends on how you're doing it, so you know yeah, you say that. And you have your what your text you want your song tour if you're doing it like that and that's it that's basically all i can tell you that's all i can tell you how to do that's how to set up a 24 7 music live stream for youtube and twitch and whatever you use streaming to but this is more against youtube so yeah thanks for watching sorry it's a bit late i know it's been two weeks but yeah thanks for watching and goodbye